Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Happy New Year everyone. My name is Marisol and I know it's kind of late to say Happy New Year because this video is probably going to go up in late January but all of January is a reason to say Happy New Year. We're in the beginning of the year. I'm going to be doing a let me introduce myself kind of video today. I realized that last year when I started this channel I didn't do any proper introduction video i kind of just jumped into things i was really excited about sharing my experiences as a new mom everything was just hitting me at once and i kind of just wanted to get the real life in the moment experience and emotion out so i just started putting my videos out but this year i want to start fresh i see that i have new subscribers and i want to say thank you to all my subscribers i'm so I'm grateful at how this channel is growing. I kind of wanted to start up the year clarifying the purpose of this channel. I realized that this channel is going to be very lifestyle based. And what that means is that you can expect to see more... The sirens are so loud. Okay. Are they almost gone? New York. New York, New York, New York. So what that means is that you can expect to see a lot more vlogs this year and of course you can still expect to see a lot more mom things. Um, I'm going to be still sharing mom tips, mom experiences and also a lot of mom support. So I want this channel to be very encouraging, very if I can do it, you can do it, don't be discouraged kind of channel. Just a channel where you know that you're going to be receiving support from someone who is just like you, someone who is a new mom. However, I want to be clear that it's not just going to be a mom-based channel because moms are interested in other things. And although the mom life is taking up like 90% of my life, um, it's not the only thing that I'm interested in as you guys can see from my previous videos I'm also interested in fashion. I'm also interested in fitness and I'm still gonna be sharing tips about those things as well So now that that's out the way, let's just get right into the video again This is a let me introduce myself kind of video. I want you guys to kind of get to know me better and uh, Let's just get started. My name is Marisol. I am 30 years old and I live in Brooklyn, New York. My mom is Ecuadorian and my father is from Puerto Rico. I grew up in a very much Hispanic household. I do speak Spanish, but how can I say this? Um, <laughs> like I'm fluent when I really, really need to be. Like if I needed to use it for work, I would use it at work, but um, I don't. I'm not as fluent as I'd like to be and I really need to practice more because I want my son to definitely be bilingual but yeah I can read and write in Spanish and I can certainly speak it if necessary but I don't speak it enough gotta work on that 2021 I've lived in Brooklyn New York almost my whole life the only other time I didn't live in Brooklyn was when I was away for college and I lived three years in Pennsylvania I have my bachelor's degree in counseling psychology and I've also been certified as a real estate agent but it didn't go any further than that because I got pregnant so currently, I am a full-time stay-at-home mom. I am a new mom to one baby boy named Leo. I am a wife to Mauricio, who is a full-time photographer and videographer. We've been married for six years. <laughs> My son loves Toy Story. That's what he's watching right now. My son is just about to turn one in a few weeks. I love to hike, I love to run, I love to play tennis. Those are three things that are really big in my life and in my family. But I also love to dress up, I love to get ready. I love doing the sporty thing and the outdoorsy thing, but I also love to just uh, dress up, even if it's just for going in a walk to a cafe I go to all the time or to a place in the city that I've been to before, I will always dress up. It's my thing. I just love getting dressed up, but also I love to be comfortable. It's weird. I know, but you see how it goes as we get to know each other. I'm very much an introvert. 
but I feel like I could be extroverted at times. With that said, I do have to say that I am not a homebody. I do not like to be at home actually. I actually love being out. So I'm just gonna turn to my phone because I wrote a whole bunch of things down and I'm starting to forget them. Mom brain um, doesn't stop at pregnancy. I am very much an animal lover. I have two cats, a male and a female, Maximo and Chloe. They are my first babies. They are my fur babies. I love them to death. They do cause a ruckus in the house, but I just, I love them so much. Um, and I do hope to get a dog in the future when we have a home. I'm really a kind of take things as they come kind of person. Um, very spontaneous. I have my limits. I'm not extremely spontaneous or carefree, but I think for the average person or organized person they would consider me as very spontaneous however i will say i am very dependable even though i don't need a plan for everything in my life if if i know somebody expects something from me or needs me to be somewhere at a certain time or needs me for any type of support i'm very much there on time for that person the way that person needs me so i will say that i do consider myself as a very dependable person and lastly i'll end this with saying when people ask me what my passion is i have to say my greatest passion is traveling i am absolutely obsessed with traveling to other places when i'm traveling i rarely rarely feel homesick i almost never feel homesick i love being in new places, being in new environments, seeing different cultures, seeing the architecture in different countries, um, just the idea of being in a new place, being in an Airbnb or a hotel, um, sitting for coffee in a street that I haven't walked down before, all of that excites me. I just love to travel. That's literally all I want to do all the time. And it's hard for someone like me when we've been stuck in quarantine for so long however becoming a mother has changed a few things in my personality i realize that i'm starting to appreciate being home a little bit more as it creates stability and a routine for my son and i um that's making it easier for me to stay home and i also feel like i'm becoming more domesticated um just being more interested in in home decorating and all of that so that's a little bit of who i am i hope that those things that i mentioned were interesting to you if you have any questions or want to know anything else about me please feel free to leave me a comment down below and i would gladly answer them i'm really excited for 2021 i love the idea of a fresh new start it doesn't matter what happened in the past this is the future right now and we just have to be intentional about making it better all we have is today so with that i will end this video and i'll see you guys in the next one bye